Alright. It's time for more satisfying bone crunching sounds. Uh, there's been several updates to this game since I last touched it, but I feel like this is a good up and coming game. So. I'm just trying to remember, like, what was the last class I played and if they've done anything. They seem to explain more. Uh, I wanted to get successful with this character, but I don't know. What have I got? Movement speed, apparently empty. Sure. Agony scales, monster count, monster health, and XP drops dynamically based on your performance. Oh, they got they got a new stage. Hmm. All right, let's try. Hey, Star, how's it going? Still up, I see. Oh wait, hang on, I need to toggle auto attack. How do you do that? It's right click, there we go. We'll see how this goes. Uh Okay, movement speed. I got the feeling I'm gonna get swarmed quickly. I'm not muted, am I? <laughs> I'm just worried that's gonna happen again. Uh, damage. They got sniper crystals. Attack speed. You're helping a friend with the front? Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, I fell asleep twice. I don't know what's wrong with me. I had the chicken ramen, was watching, then fell asleep. Woke up, then kept watching, then fell asleep again. It's only Tuesday, like, man. 15% multi-strike. Alright, sure. Oh yeah, no, we don't want to go to the well yet. I've got a couple things I want to do tonight. It's a little different. I haven't played this in a while, and I want to see what updates they've done to it. Sleepy time, yeah, but I shouldn't be sleepy. It's the sleepy music, you know, I think that might be it. But the music you were playing was very chill. Sure. But also you're doing building stuff and... I find build, watching building stuff is chill. Is this like Vampire Survivors? It is. Um, it's called Halls of Torment, and this is an upcoming game in the genre, but what's good about this one is it kind of mixes elements from Diablo. So uh, you have gear with affixes, and it's the same system. You know, kill stuff, survive, level up, and you pick skills. But, uh, it has loot like Diablo, so that's pretty much the appeal of it.
It's also a bit harder. The vampire survivors, eventually you can end up and be in a position where you're just never gonna die. This the entire time you were clenching. Like, I can't say I've ever gotten to a point where I, I feel like, okay, I'm not gonna die. Hey, Messiah, how's it going? How's things? I'm alright, I'm just counting down the time until I'm done for the, uh... I like it so far. It also has satisfying sounds of enemy bones crunching. I'm good at metabolism. Am I counting? <laughs> nah. It's just like, I got three more work days to get through and then I'm done. It's just... One, uh, mental reset, you know? It's, it's been a long year. And also, it's just the Christmas tradition. I'm looking forward to it. It's just... I play a game from my childhood for Christmas. I watch Jingle All The Way. So this year, it's Yoshi's Island for the Christmas game. And then people want me to try eggnog, so I'm gonna look into buying it this weekend. So that's probably gonna be a thing. Because, I don't know, maybe it is a thing here and I guess in the circles that I grew up in, just no one had it. But I don't know anyone that drinks it, so. For the sake of content, I'll, I'll try it. So that'll probably happen during Yoshi's Island, or if we choose to watch Jingle all the way! Hey, 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 hey. I almost fucked up. Jeez, uh, jingle all the way then, during that. I think they drink eggnog in that movie. <laughs> hey, Nick, though. I can't help but watch that movie every year. Uh, attack speed. I don't know if they've done something to the archer, but it feels less like I'm gonna get overwhelmed quickly. Hey, is it Twitch yet? You wouldn't say it's great, it's okay, should try it, might like it. Yeah. I think it'll just be fun. Just like, well. If other people are going to have it as well, then that gives me more incentive to do so. I'm willing to try new things. What would range do? I'm not quite sure what range does with an archer. I'll go with... Oh. Maybe they just travel further before they fall off? I don't know.
So I'll play this for a while and then I got um, another game that I want to play. It's a bit more chill. Um, it's free for one thing. Um, but it, it also comes in a series. They have this game where you just have to find cats in a drawing. So I'm going to look for cats in a drawing. It's like Where's Waldo slash Where's Wally, but it's cats. So if you're a fan of cats... They have uh, a free one out for Christmas, so... But they also have the entire thing on sale. It's only like a couple bucks, so... Yeah, I mean... I kinda need to fill in the time, because I'm not gonna start something new till Monday. And maybe I'll embarrass myself with Yakuza later. I don't know if I feel like it. I had to play the rhythm game twice yesterday, and that... That did not go well. Oh, that thing looks brutal. Uh, let me pick up the scroll. Okay, um... Go regen. Needles, flame strike, not melee, summon a clay golem. I'll do needle strike. That seems like it's something an archer would use. A little to the left was cute. I hear they have a DLC for that game. But I haven't checked it out yet. I might be up late today just because I've had two old man naps. <laughs> so, that, uh, I sound like a child. It's just like, oh no, he slept. That means he's not going to be able to go to bed later. Anyway. Phantom Needles. I don't know how much time is left. The thing I don't like about this UI is, like, the things relating to time remaining somewhere in the corner. I guess I just haven't trained my eye to look there and look back. How's everyone else doing? Enjoying your Monday slash Tuesday. I'll go movement speed. Pick up radius. I think I'm gonna head to the scroll. Ah! <laughs> Boring day, really. Oh, jeez. It is quite humid here, so... Potentially another reason if it stays. I wish it would explain some of this more. If it stays that way, then I'm probably going to be up. Okay. 
está. Nice and snowy still. I honestly wish just things would become summer already. Just stay stay with the warm weather. It's just alternating between rain, humidity. When I have to leave the house, it's just like... It's always the choice of, do I take a hoodie? Do, 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 what's going on? Do I change out of shorts? So it's starting to get a little scary. I have multiple elites chasing me and they're not really dying. multi-strike. Keep running. Okay, there are 18 minutes left. Ah. Okay, I got an attack speed modifier. Get him. Probably won't be able to get that anytime soon. Uh, extra base attacks, sure. Defeat a basilisk. Okay, guys, just please let me be in a scroll. Phantom Rift. When the needles disappear, they deal magic damage in an area. Damage is increased for... Okay. It's an upgrade. Oh, that's cool. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, this is getting scary. Uh... Collateral damage area? Okay. That'll probably help the needles. Three... 0.3 attacks to you for 10 seconds for each kill. Pick up radius. XP gain. Wait. So hang on, how does this work? It's like you get 30% XP gain, but then every level you lose 0.5. That's something that has... Eventually, it won't gain you more. I think the Wind Crown. Probably the best thing. Uh, hold on. That's what I want. Emits four frost projectiles in diagonal directions. Deals mediocre damage, but has a chance to apply frost effect. That's probably decent. Just crowd control. I'm gonna hang around here. Yep. 
Yeah, good. Oh, yeah, good one. Uh, good health. I, uh, I mean, I assume I'm like halfway through this. I've got crit chance. Oh boy. That seems so insignificant. But I guess if... It would be confusing in general, but I think the way this works is just... It says to base, so it's probably a case of like... It does a lot in the long run because it's at the start of the damage calculation or something. That's how it works in other games. Oh, oh okay. You know what? The ice was a mistake because now I have a projectile that looks similar to an enemy projectile. Uh, 20% thrust chance, sure. downloaded all my Twitch clips for the year, and I'm gonna start stitching them together this week. Some pretty fu fun stuff <laughs> that I forgot happened. I could almost make like a little compilation of the noises I've made. Nothing too horrendous this year. It's fine, everything is under control. Keep going with Frost, because then if I pick up that scroll, it'll get an upgrade. Dude must have massive arm um, shooting like that. Yeah, well. I know it takes a l The bigger the birds, it requires a lot more strength to draw. I learned that from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Jojo is great. It's like it teaches you something, and then within 15 seconds, it just becomes absurd. It's just like, oh no, okay, I see. This is just completely ridiculous now. I mean, it's just. 
same capabilities as Legolas, I guess. Oh, what the... What is that? It's like a crab bot or something. projectiles in the direction of facing. Damage is reduced for every hit. Applies to fragile. That's probably a good thing. I don't know if I'm going to survive. It's starting to get sketchy. You see what I mean? Like, there hasn't been a period where I've felt, okay, this is... I'm fine now. I've hit my stride <laughs> the entire time. It's just been, well, I, I am focusing to try and survive. I mean, I like vampire survivors because you turn off your brain and it's satisfying getting to the point where nothing can touch you. But this is also good. Okay. Grab spell. Uh, the orbs. Okay, there's ten minutes left. blessing. Fragile chance, affliction chance. I guess if we want to rely on fragile for damage. Needle fire rate, orbs, increase area and damage, but then range is reduced. Alright, do that. There's no downside to that. That thing in the middle is very tanky. Uh, frost. I haven't tried the Vampire Survivors co-op mode because I added that recently. They've also got another patch coming out for it, which is going to cross over with Among Us. Which, huh. I don't know how that's going to work, but...
Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm gonna trust that these little numbers are gonna do something. That's worthwhile. Okay, bear down. <laughs> oh, this thing is blocking me. Quick freeze. Frost avalanche will now leave trails of ice that slow down enemies. Apparently I crit 20,000 times in a single run. I thought it was going to go down. Defeated the Twisted Construct. Per one HP missing, do damage. That sounds kind of sick. Yeah. I'm missing half my health, so why not? no way to uh because the curse is kind of hard to see i was kind of hoping there'd be a way to change the color of it but there doesn't appear to be okay I'll just deal with it i mean <laughs> the background is very much a similar color These eyes ain't what they used to be. Looking good. Going with the orbs. All right, I'm going for the other scroll. Thank you, Ugh, the carrots.
This thing is causing me so many problems. Oh, I don't know if that was worth it. Okay. Get to the scroll. Uh, go health. Oh, nice. That's cool. Just two minutes remaining. <laughs> Just hang in there. Movement speed. That laser thing is so annoying. I'm trying to take it out. There we go. It's down. Nope. Oh, I am being ballsy here. Okay. Electrified orbs. Orbs deal damage based on their movement speed. Okay, cool. Speed on the needles. Oh boy. All right, here we go. I'm gonna keep my distance. Uh, pick up radius, frost chance, frost chance. Oh. Cheeky and pick up the XP that I couldn't pick up. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, 
Okay, fine, fine. Oh, nice. Yep. Give me that. Extra damage. Not stand still. <laughs> I'll be happy if I win this first round. Also, it'll be the first time winning with this character. <laughs> okay, shut up and focus. Just me, or is it getting quicker? Uh, no, we're gonna go offense. Like, I could have gained health. No, oh, I might regret this. Okay, that's healthier. Yeah, no, he's, he's definitely. Yep, okay. He is definitely speeding up. This is getting harder to dodge. I swear if there's a phase two. <laughs> no, okay. Ugh. I think I had like just under 100 health left. Okay, cool. This is a new class. Beast Huntress? You got a doggo. I didn't get to keep the items that I got though, which is kind of lame. I probably should have thrown them in the well. When he's not using a main attack, yeah. I'm not sure how this class plays. I'll just pick some of these items to take in. Hmm. 
mean, there's no reason not to. Oh, here we go. Uh, health, health regen, defense, movement speed, pick up radius, gold gain. Burn damage, revives. I guess I can afford another revive. I have yet to beat this stage. Oh. It's like javelins, okay. Doggo also helps. Movement speed always. I can't see how you can win a run without getting movement speed. Just bosses move too quickly later. This character seems extra slow. Uh, go pick up radius. so far. I like it. It's just, I'm worried this movement speed. <laughs> You'd be dead already? Nah. It's not that bad. It's just like vampire survivors. At a certain point, there's always a time when, you know, when it reaches six minutes, there's a test Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember this now. Uh, 15% ice damage. No, we're going movement speed and health. I need to get to a point where I feel comfortable. It's cool that these spears seem to explode. attack speed more often. I like playing as the Amazonian in Diablo, so it's just giving me vibes of that. Attack speed. Seems to be all right dealing with crowds. I'm a little stressed. Force means. Force improves all attacks and abilities in different ways. Usually it increases stats like duration, piercing, knockback, and others. 
Oh, okay. I hadn't seen piercing show up, so okay, that makes sense. They've like combined it into a single stat. That makes sense. Okay, force. We want these javelins to pierce. Movement speed. Now it feels like a normal character. Doesn't feel slow. Movement speed. Speed. I'm a bit concerned that I haven't really done much damage to this first elite. Multi-strike would do anything here. I'm just gonna go for damage, I think. Like, just make a single throw strong instead of getting multiple projectiles. Nearly down. There we go. Uh, emits. Yeah, let's do duality. Like fire and ice. Oh, that's going to be annoying. I hope it doesn't negate the ice. That would be a big mistake. It'd be hilarious. <laughs> but... No, it looks like it's applying both. Okay. going to be annoying to take out. Uh, ice. I mean, I am damaging. Uh, too slow. Moving too slow. Oh, that was not good. Uh, go with the fire. This thing has to go. It's causing me problems.
uh, area. Hopefully the ice explosion benefits from it. Oh great, now I got another elite on me. Kill with 10% chance plus 1 HP on full health to increase damage. 40% summon spawns not gonna help. When you die, the seal breaks and revives you for half your health. Nah, no, let's go with this. That's what it's like. I have a chance to gain health on kill. Doesn't seem like there's a cap. See. 720 health. See how long it takes for it to go off. Oh wait, is it? No, I don't think it's increased max health. I think it's heal for one health. Which, I don't know. Okay. I would assume it's working. Got area damage. Three defense, I guess, because you get the extra defense. I think this fire and ice combo is working pretty well. Yeah, good, yep. Run into the enemy. Good work. <laughs> ah! Uh... Cripper, I just lean into damage. Okay, there we go. Uh, Dragon's Breath knocks back enemies. Instead of emitting a single wave of fire, Dragon's Breath emits a quick but continuous stream of fire. That one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yo, this is sick. Because it lines up with the spear throw. It's like a death beam. Uh, I think it might be cancelling out the ice. Whoa, what the hell? Whoa, 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 what's going on? Why is it... It's flame strike. Oh no, we're leaning into like this elemental thing. This is cool. More ice. Because we've got ice damage, so... It should affect what I have.
And now I don't have to worry about the cursor so much because um, the beams are letting me know where I'm aiming with the spear as well. Now it's super obvious where I'm aiming. going with the ice. Keep going with the ice. Multi-strike ability plus area. Okay. Good movement speed. Ah. Oh, thank you. There we go. A little bit of heal. Oh, boy. Okay. That's not good. Uh. Boss. it affects knockback and the beam knocks back I'm going for the other scroll on the other side of the bridge uh damage leaning into damage, like I'm not going too much into regen. Nice. I lost it immediately, <laughs> but nice. Uh, keep going with main weapon. Okay, there's a scroll. Ooh, that was bad. Uh, I'll get a little metabolism. Okay, quick freeze. Yep. This is the furthest I've gotten in this stage. I have done poorly in this stage before. Um... Oh, invincibility. Nice. Uh... Crit. It's gonna get up close for this. Oh, 
getting cocky with this one. Uh, wait, proficient stance, wild hound, attack speed on the hound, area damage, but then the base damage is reduced. Okay. It attacks quicker. Broker's cape spreads a random debuff in a three meter range. Oh no, that one, attack speed while, uh, there it is again. Attack speed while health smithing. Let's go. I have a lot of health missing. Health is better. Health is better. I actually do a lot of damage when my health is low. This is a cool build, being able to do fire and ice. Area damage. Blades act like boomerangs. Multi strike. I'll try the ring blades. This seems like it would complement this pretty well. Attack speed. Probably invest in multi strike because that's what's giving me the triple beam. Ten minutes left.
This class is pretty good. I was concerned at the start because of the movement speed, but... It seems like it gets up and running pretty quickly. So why not? Have your dog deal one million damage. <laughs> yeah. Doggo is carrying his weight. Whoa, 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 what is this? Uh... Okay, multi strike. Since I do have things that scale with it. Okay, it looks like I can damage these things. This is either something I can do about or something that's gonna bone me. Oh, whoa! Oh, I see what this is. How did I not see that before? strike I'm not really doing much damage to it oh god uh, metabolism. I can't get close to it. might be fucked. I need to hang back for a minute. No. Ah. Uh, okay. Pause. <laughs> I got a res. Just drinking some water. That was rough. Okay, this is where it's problematic. Oh, really? Now I get food? Okay, I'm gonna take advantage of this. Knockback enemies do it. Multi strike. Oh, this thing has to go down, otherwise, I'm going to lose.
I gotta take out this thing first. Okay. Oh. Um, adds two projectiles per cycle. Alright, cool. Ooh, this is annoying. It spawned some phantom head. Oh boy. Okay. Um. I don't know if I'm gonna survive this. This boss is insane. Metabolism. It's just. I know I'm playing a bit defensive. Ah. Well, I did better than last time. This level's hard. I think the class is fun, though. So. The other character which stuck was the Warlock, so I want to see if the Warlock's changed since last time. It really did not do well, so let's see if they've done anything to it. I'll play the same level again. The problem with the Warlock is just... These things kind of do whatever they want to do. I'm gonna go with auto aim as well. Let's just see how it works. Yeah, this doesn't feel any different. <laughs> with this character, the struggle bust was just so obvious at the start. Because you don't have fine control over these things. They kind of just do whatever they want. But my hope was that it's something that accelerates quickly, so we'll see what they've done with it. We'll go attack speed. God. Yeah, yeah, good. Uh, I'll go pick up radius. Just make it easy to pick up. Movement speed's not bad on the character. They just kind of float off and they don't target everything. Okay, um, movement speed, 
block and defense. I guess three stats. Can't ignore that. Good stuff for this. Uh, okay. Multi strike spawns. Force. Good. I've been getting force, so that kind of bounces out. I mean, it, it definitely seems to have some sort of improvement since last time, but I'm still feeling the pressure. Oh, uh, damage. The problem was that I couldn't focus on bosses. The ghosts would not prioritize them. Even if I turn manual off and have the arrow directly on there, they wouldn't come back and attack. I turned auto aim off for the time being. Attack speed. Go make myself a little tanky. I guess I, I guess I'm just getting unlucky with the options it's giving me. I don't know. Yeah, this is this is bad. Because with the other character, I had already taken this thing out, and then the knight appears. I have I haven't even gotten it to a two thirds health, and already the knight on the horse has appeared. And I have this to deal with as well. This is the same problem as last time. It just it's very hard to focus a particular target.
Like, it just seems to do damage to a lot of things, but sometimes you don't want that. Maybe this class just doesn't gel with me. I don't know. Same thing, I was just hoping that as I leveled it up it would just feel stronger, but... I feel weaker compared to the other classes. Good, there's a third boss here now because I haven't been able to take down the first two. Yeah, this is gonna go nowhere, but I'll try my best. I was just curious if they've done anything to this class to make it feel better for me, but. It seems to have the same problems as before. I think what they need to do to improve this class is like if you have auto aim off or even if it's on just get the get the summons to attack a big elite twice or three times like prioritize that target and then it would feel fine because as it stands right now they hit it once and then they just go off and do other things and it just doesn't do that much damage to it like the point of a summon class is you summon typically focuses down a target, and they overwhelm the target. I think honestly that's all it needs is just target prioritization somehow. Yeah, this is going nowhere. <laughs> and I have two of these guys, <laughs> two of these guys chasing me. All right, well. Maybe let him attack quicker, I don't know. Something that just means more average damage to a 
the boss character because it's just you just fall behind I've been fighting this thing for like 10 minutes. <laughs> That's so annoying. Nah, I'm done. This character just... I don't know. It needs work. Just... Let's compare it. Let's compare it to to this character here. I was going to die like either way. The archer feels a lot better. Look at this. Like, just look at how quick I'm ripping through stuff with this already. This class is really good. I had a lot of fun with this class. But all the other classes are like this to some extent. Like, they have their strength. That one... Unless I'm doing something wrong, I just can't get off the ground with it ever. It doesn't seem like a summoning class, it just seems like piercing projectiles, exactly. I think all they need to do to that class is just let the minions attack the big enemies multiple times and just let them go for the big enemies multiple times and that would work. Because then it's like, okay, the summons are prioritizing something. <laughs> Is this easy mode? There's no, there's no voice lines in this. Okay, we don't want to reduce area, we want to increase area and range. This is the strat. Um, this is too good to pass up. Movement speed and regen, hell yeah. So let's just see, the first boss, what, like I couldn't take down and I was fighting it for 10 minutes? Let's see what happens here. area thank you and range I just want to be this massive cleave uh, attack speed You know, it's not like by playing one class, you get an advantage. Like, all of them have the same... I'll go... Metabolism. Alright, so let's see. Me focusing down the boss. Oh, look. Look at how much health... Look at how much health it's already lost. That took me, like... 
It's been less than 30 seconds and it's already down to half health. Like that, I'm sorry, that class is just dumb. They need to just completely rework that class. <laughs> Range. The summons were doing 69. Haha. <laughs> Um, 69 damage per hit. This class is doing like a hundred. It's already doing 300. Even without the rolls that I have, it was doing about the same initially. Okay, well, there you go. The lightning strikes. Let's go. Area. Yeah, I don't know. The last time I played this, that class just didn't gel with me. It's just... I think it's... You know, they need to have a summoning class, because it's supposed to mimic Diablo. But... It's just not done well. Oh, this class is great. I had a lot of fun with it. Because it gets to the point where... It, because he attacks twice quickly, and then there's like a pause and he doesn't attack, it gets pretty clenched later. Area damage! Increases area damage. All about the area damage. I just think the problem is the average damage with that class. That's all it is. Range. I think this has to be my favorite class. It just feels satisfying to like. Attack speed. Effect chance debuff. Multi strike. Nope, multi strike. Get that chance for the extra cleave. Yeah, three hits in a row. Uh, lightning attack. Regeneration plus force on the main weapon. Um, eh, I'll say. Getting regeneration is probably a good idea. Of course. <laughs> the cleave is already pretty big. Alright, let's see how long it takes me to fight this thing. Oh, look how much health it lost. Oh, look at that. What's that? What's that? It's already lost like half its health. Get absolutely fucking destroyed. Every five seconds, you summon an imp. Changes the damage into fire. Interesting. Let's try that. Oh, okay. It 
so now if I get debuffs because it's fire, it's even better. <laughs> now I'm literally blazing through them. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Block. Is this one a tank up as well? Uh, base defense and movement speed. Yeah, can't go wrong with that. Speed or I'll go attack speed. <laughs> so good. Uh, okay, yep. Add area. That's what we were waiting for. Okay, here we go. Next boss. Okay. Radiant Aura. Let's do this. <laughs> yes. It's this game's garlic. Increase that no, we want area increase, not damage increase. Uh crit pickup radius, we'll get regen. Attack speed, no thank you. Area, yes please. Attack speed, no thank you, range, or multi-strike, multi-strike. I want that triple hit to go off more often. Uh, regen. Damage, go damage. Next boss. Psst. Okay. 
Hey, how about more fire? Um, burn chance. Let's go. This blast wave is ridiculous in size now because of all the area damage I've been stacking. Range and area sounds good to me. There it is. Oh no, wait, but that's reduction in area, never mind. Uh, movement speed. I don't know if there's one that increases the area of the circle around me. Or even if it just increased damage and didn't increase radius, it'd be fine. I'm going for the other scroll now. Attack speed, area damage, range, that sounds great. <laughs> the cleave is absolutely gigantic now. Uh, burn chance, sure. I haven't done crit. I don't think we need to do crit. I'm doing pretty well without it. Defense, movement speed, damage, air. See, I don't want to reduce the area. I'll go range. Multi-strike area damage, yep, take that. Should be able to get the upgrade now. Uh, I'll do the knockback. Instead of the continuous beam thing. Thirty percent effect chance. Attack speed. Yeah, do that. Next boss. Gee, I wonder which class needs work.
Uh, defense, movement speed, yep. Sounds good to me. Requires to be charged, 30 seconds. On hit, negate damage, charges used. While charged, 30% force, plus damage. Crit base. Increase block strength while moving. Hmm. Kinda cool. That one seems legit. I might even retrieve those. So I can use them for other characters. Um, I'm gonna pick up. I might just take it to the well. The tanky classes could benefit from that. It doesn't seem to want to give me one where it's like just damage up. Another area. I may have to just take that. Doesn't seem to be reducing the area by that much. Give damage. Uh, damage. basically racing to the other side of the screen now. Uh, I'll do more regen. At this point, there is absolutely zero chance the summon would get this far. It just... there's no way. This isn't Vampire Survivors. In the same realm of it. Let's just think Vampire Survivors crossed over with Diablo. you've got uh, like a loadout and you find Diablo style loot I like it it's harder because though you can get strong at no point do I feel like oh I'm never gonna die
Okay. This dude messed me up last time. Yeah, okay. Um, stream of fire. <laughs> All right. How well I'm doing with this class compared to the Warlock, it's... It'd be a nice game on the Switch. Looks like it's Steam early. It's in early access. Maybe it'll eventually make its way over. mitigate damage so then the regen actually comes in handy. Right, I'm gonna keep heading towards the well. I like the visuals. Just has that Diablo 2 feel to it. Uh damage. Okay, um this is going we retrieve, so now that'll be available in other runs. Probably buy it if it was on Switch. It might get there one day. I mean, there's definitely improvements that can be made. Not all the classes are equal. In terms of how good they feel. And also the key difference to this is like, you fight a boss at the end. So it's not like uh, the run ends and you die and that's how the run ends. This, you have to beat a boss. Big dragon's gonna appear any minute now. There it is. All right, let's see what I can do. To oh, okay. If I be super aggressive, to what I do. This, this class is insane. <laughs> I struggled to do anything to this last time. Leaves a trail of fire burning enemies. More fire, please. Hell yes. Look at this now. I don't want- 
Oh no, that's the area. Oh, hell yeah. Yes! Look at the fire burn! Eh? Yes! I'm not used to the new warrior voice. I don't know. It's very hard to replace Charles Martinet. I don't think the new voice actor has enough gruff in the voice. that thing over there? There's like an old man over there. I just noticed there's an icon of an old man. <laughs> They're burning up. I don't know how much damage that's doing, but... Oh, shit. Okay. Um. Well, what do... I can't go past this now. Oh, get wrecked. Permits an additional magic attack that can apply fragile and affliction to all enemies. Yes. <laughs> oh, it's fine. Just oh, my God. Explosive strike. When lightning strikes deal a critical hit, it causes an explosion that deals fire. Yes. More fire. <laughs> Burn them all. Waiting for a boss to come and throw water at me. <laughs> My only weakness. I'm curious if you can actually break through this. Doesn't seem like it, but I'll keep trying. It seems like I'm gonna make make through. It just takes a while. Oh, there's like a massive legion behind. Okay, let's do it. Death! Oh no, I will definitely break through. I just need to keep at it. I think there's a gap there now. Go. I did it. Uh, pick up radius. Right 
This is the background music from the game itself. Yeah, this is the game's music. I'm not playing anything. Metabolism. Acquire trait metabolism 5 on a run. Alright, there you go. Oh, there's two minutes left. Shit. Okay. There's an old man here. Right carefully, my friend. Those scribblings keep the wraiths at bay. <laughs> I love how they've made this creatures just feel like it's a game from the 1990s. Carrier situation. My potion flask. If you could retrieve it for me, somewhere further northbound. They're my brows, though. Forever in your debt. Oh, it's like all. Ooh, well, I got a minute to do it. Um, flame strike. More fire! Oh my god, that thing got just melted. Fire! I'll try and do it. I got a minute to do it in. I took a massive hit there. Uh, strength. I do like that this has quests. Okay, got it. Now I just need to make my way back. <laughs> Fire. I can't do the voice. <laughs> it's been a minute since I've seen Davis and Dotted. Channel the inner Colin Holio. My hopes were not in Oh, wow. Please take good care of yourself. The boss music just started. <laughs> I got it. Just as the clock hits zero. Unbelievable. Okay, that's... Okay, but dude, look at the... Look at the amount of damage I'm doing to this thing. Oh, get absolute Get absolutely d destroyed. Like, yep. Okay. That wasn't... do you know, this class is pretty good. Just gonna say that again. This class is great. I love this class. It's just when you compare it... It's just when you compare it to that other dude, it's just... Oh, I got Sorceress now. That's a new class. Yeah, I guess that was it. Mistress of Lightning, electrifying enemies like no other. Nimble and good at blocking. Vulnerable, but has additional... Wait, but haste? Oh, that's a typo. Focus on summon. It is just, it's, I'm sorry. Like, this class just sucks. 
<laughs> it really does. Everyone else just feels so fun to play. This one, it's just a struggle right off the bat. Alright, I'm gonna find out who this dude that we rescued is. It is a great relief to see you again. My humble service. Rafik the cupbearer. They are the only thing that I can currently offer in return for my rescue, besides my eternal gratefulness. Services? Question mark. I can supply you with beverages and potions that might increase your odds down in the halls. For now, a bottle of wine is all I can offer. But if you'd find the right ingredients and additional flasks, I could expand my repertoire. Glad he's not identifying items I like Deckard. Deckard! Um, so that's cool. I mean, there's just more things to... to, uh... find down there. So, you know, I'm just gonna put points into AoE. There we go. Okay, well, I mean, there's more to do. With early access games, I try not to do too much with them because eventually I hit a point where I don't have any content to do and then I just don't play them again for a really long time. So I think that's good. I, I checked out the new class. I think they've definitely improved Archer. Archer felt a lot better this time around. Um, not so much Warlock. Warlock, uh, I could see that they've done something. And it seems like the summons do move in a better pattern now, but it's it's still the same problem. It's just you're on the back foot from the get-go and you just don't really gain steam as quick as the other characters. I don't know. I'm not a fan of that class. I haven't tried Sorceress, but we'll try it next time. Alright. Let's leave it at that for now. I didn't quit to the main menu, I just quit, but... <laughs> If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end, then you know what to do if you want to support channel stuff, button, clicky, thing, whatever I usually say. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching.